Hey, what's up, guys? As you all know, I have my Xfinity 4K box Comcast receiver. Uh, it doesn't support any 4K programming. What it does support, it supports the upscale to 4K, and it also supports uh, Netflix 4K HDR app, so you can watch Netflix in 4K and HDR. However, it does have the upscaling capabilities, and... Uh, what I basically am going to do is I'm going to plug in my HDMI 2.1 cable. Currently, I have my uh, standard HDMI 2.0 cable. I'm going to connect my HDMI uh, 2.1 cable from Belkin, and then we're going to test that out. Okay, currently, this is what I have on Sony X900E uh, right there, and this is how the picture looks pretty much. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to switch it back to my HDMI 2.1 Belkin cable. I'm going to connect it to this device. I understand that this device doesn't support uh, 2.1 chipsets, but I'm going to try it anyway. I just want to see if I can notice any kind of difference at all. So I'm going to go ahead and switch back to HDMI 2.1. All right, so here's HDMI 2.1. I don't notice any drastic difference at all. Uh, I do notice that it's uh, a little bit faster, like when you switch back to HDMI 3, where I have connected my 2.1 Belkin cable, I do notice that it's a bit faster. Um, and uh, I did notice that it's a bit, just a slightly bit more vivid. Like, it's just a bit more sharper you know i mean with my old cable it just it wasn't as as sharp as i'm seeing it right now so it's just a little bit sharper remember this is being upscaled to 4k and i can show it to you right now i can go to my uh, info on xfinity which i'm gonna do actually right now we're gonna do this without any editing i do have my uh gopro hero 6 camera with the overhead light that i attach so let me go to a settings let's go click on the xfinity and let's go to the settings should be right over here uh let's go to uh device settings let's go to video display and you can see that uh the output resolution it's set to a 16 by 9 2160 p 60 hertz 4k uhd best available now, this zoom, it's only if they are like non widescreen uh, 4 by 3 types of programming. What it does basically, it fits in that screen to 16 by 9. So, as you can see, everything it's set to uh, 4K UHD. Uh, the cable box I'm using is XG1V4. It also recognizes what, uh, what type of TV it is. It tells you right away the chip that's built inside the X1. Uh, not the X1 uh, Sony, the, the chip that's built inside the XG1 Xfinity cable box, it detects that I have Sony, and it's what it's doing, it's outputting the best possible 4K upscaling uh, resolution here. And actually, it looks quite good, it's not that bad. So let me go ahead, let me take my remote, let me uh, click exit. <laughs> It really actually does look pretty good on Sony X900E. Even with all the lights that I have here, as you can see, I got a bunch of lights, lights here, lights there, lights everywhere. Uh, it actually really looked good. Let's go hit ESPN. ESPN. And uh, let's see how ESPN looks really quick. It looks pretty, uh, it looks pretty sharp though. Here we go. I have to say, it looks pretty sharp. Let me get a little bit closer. For uh, We have to remember, a lot of these programmings are set to 720p or uh, 900p, or in some cases, 1080i interlace. Okay, so what's happening here, we're getting a 1080i and 720p uh, different variety of programming source resolution that's being upscaled to 4k and it does a really good job considering that the source resolution on comcast it's usually 1080i interlace 
or 720p and uh it looks pretty uh it looks pretty good so but i don't really notice any difference i just want to tell you guys uh i just see a slightly 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 little bit sharper image quality just a slightly a little bit sharper image quality but nothing too drastic let's go hit uh fs1 that's my favorite sports network right there the fs1 man i love fox sports one they're the best sorry just the way i feel about fs1 because i watch a lot of ufc okay so <laughs> And uh, it doesn't look that bad. It doesn't look that bad at all, man. Uh, hold on. Let me uh, adjust my uh, low light on this uh, GoPro Hero 6 camera. There, I adjusted my uh, light on the GoPro Hero 6 camera. So it actually looks... It looks pretty good, though. It's not bad. Considering that this is a... 1080i interlace being upscaled to 4k okay uh, a not really good source all right the xfinity it's not outsourcing a full native 1080p if xfinity was outsourcing a full native 1080p then the upscale would look hell of a lot better i think direct tv is the only one and at&t direct tv and at&t are two companies right now well joint companies that uh take the advantage of full native 1080p uh, source resolution and then upscale to 4K, which makes it look even more better on your television sets. So there you have it, guys. Thank you uh, for watching. Just a quick little video. I'll be back later on with the uh, BenQ 4K HDR projector test of uh, Far Cry 5 Xbox One X enhanced game. Thank you for watching.